It's really important that students have the opportunity to follow up once the field work has taken place. They need to think about the questions that they came up with originally, they need to reflect on those questions and think about the data that they collected and the way they collected it. Did that enable them to answer those questions? They need to think about the quality of their data presentation, their analysis and their conclusions. However, the most important thing is actually linking those steps together. So through the six step inquiry process, how effective was their methodology? how accurate was their data collection and what impact that will have on their reliability of their results and the validity of their conclusions. When students are commenting on the validity and reliability of their results, it's important they're able to kind of critically reflect on the geographical investigation process. Really, students need to demonstrate their specific fieldwork understanding when they're commenting on validity and reliability and really drill down into the detail, specifically when they're looking at the results, which should ultimately support them with the assessment of their fieldwork. We facilitate conclusions with the students by having, first of all, the hypotheses before we go, so they know clearly what they're meant to be doing, and then in class time we will use results that they've gained in secondary data to put together a variety of graphical and written information and analysis to help them with their exam questions when they come to them. The main outcomes that we would like to see from the students' inquiries, first of all, they've enjoyed themselves and it's enriched the geography that they know. More specifically for the fieldwork investigations, we'd like them to be able to be critically more fluent, to be able to understand the methodology they've done, to understand the outcomes and be able to assess the positives and negatives of the way they've done things during that fieldwork.